Hey guys, something a little bit different today. Today we're road testing a Lego Great Ball contraption. Yeah, you know, one of those things that you see the balls go round and around. Well, this one here was made by Josh David, and he's been kind enough to put a tutorial together. So I thought I'd give it a try. So if you want to see how this works, hang around and let's do this. Okay, so this is the Mini Loop 01. It's a great ball contraption and uh, well I like it because it actually just loops on itself which means you don't need to have other modules or maybe if you made a few of these different types you could actually loop them together. So let's just see how it works. There's a little uh, gear at the back here that when you turn it it actually turns this wheel at the front. So let's get some balls into it and see it in action. So we'll just pop these balls in and we'll just see how it works. So as I turn the little wheel at the back, it actually turns this big wheel at the front and the balls just continue to go around and around. Now, there is a little bit of a problem there, as you see. One of them don't seem to come out sometimes. But uh, ultimately, it seems to be a pretty good little module. Now, I did have trouble making this module because, well, the instructions weren't really too clear. Uh, a lot of pieces I couldn't tell what part number they were or what size they were so as you see I've got some bits hanging off things just haven't really been built exactly in the same form uh, I didn't bother with the little tray down here either for the ball so uh, I just wanted to get the concept and to see if it's something that I actually liked and whether you guys want to see some of these great ball contraptions yourself I've always loved building contraptions and uh, well, until I, when I can get these balls, I can start actually doing some bigger models. So let's plug in and uh, see how she goes. So the best thing about this great ball contraption is that it actually it can be motor driven. You obviously don't want to be turning these things the whole time. And uh, we just pop this in here. Now you can get away with a medium sized motor. I just happen to have a large one here. so. Let's just turn that on and uh, let's see it in action. So there's a couple of little teething problems here. Now the balls don't always come across as you'd expect. I don't know why that is. Uh, eventually they do sort themselves out. But uh, for it to be a, a decent great ball contraption, you need it to actually run continually for a long time. So that's all going to be part of the design element. So what do you think of this great ball contraption? Do you like the design? Do you want to see more of these on this channel? I'm happy to make some of these. Uh, I don't think I'll be making any more of Josh Davids though because uh, I did find those tutorials way too hard and this model took way too much time. Uh, I would actually probably be able to build something a lot quicker if I just did it in free form. So let me know in the comments if you want to see more Lego Great Ball contraptions and I'll see if I can make one of my own in the next few weeks. So until next time, it's bye for now.